All right, guys. Hello. Welcome back. Welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider 1 on the PS1 with me, Classic Gamer, playing this blind. Now, a lot of these, some of these levels, as you guys know, I have been looking up what to do. Because when I get stuck, I just, I don't want to be wandering around for ages. I've made that clear, very clearly. I've made that clear in the past. I hate standing somewhere and not, and not being able to do something or not knowing what to do. I get, it, it frustrates me. If I'm honest, now from what I understand, this is quite a long level, um, but we're gonna work. We're gonna go and see what happens. So it looks like we need another key. No. And I, I love the way this game just introduces all this music, and it's the same music all the time. It doesn't change or anything like that. Now you have to pull this block. Now, can I just ask something very important? If you pull something like that from a pillar like that, how the fuck does that not fall down? Do you understand what I mean by that? I mean, if you did that in real life, the whole place would cave in. Well, maybe not completely at first. So, I feel, I watch um, a person do a <coughs> review on this game. He's called uh, Darkness the Cur the Cur the Darkness the Curse, or the Curse of Darkness. One of the one of those two. And um, I, lo I love the way he describes um, uh, if Lara runs out of bullets and he goes, no, the answer is no, she doesn't. <laughs> I just, I always find that amusing the way he describes it. It's just, it's so, um, cause it's absolutely true. And it's, it's the way, he, it's the voice he uses just, you know, makes me chuckle a little bit. Uh I don't know what that opened. It's somewhere in this room. <laughs> but I thought I was going to uh, just, you know, not play it much tonight. And just, just play the, the last level and then that's it but really i just i think if i can get this done this uh this particular level done tonight and then come back at this in the morning i think that would be a really good place to stop okay so we want to jump now we need to not fall off
How much ammo does he have? Now I think this will give me 375. Now the guy I'm watching has over a thousand ammo. Yeah. Uh, each of those clips give you 50 bullets. Actually, quite a lot considering. Now what would have been cool for Tomb Raider for this Tomb Raider at least is um, if they had uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, Given it sort of a hard or easy difficulty, you know, with more ammo, more health, you know, just that kind of thing. I think that would have uh, that would have sort of made the game a bit more. But back then, there wasn't really um, a lot of games didn't really have modes in terms of difficulty. Resident Evil did, you know, Silent Hill did that kind of thing. But the games like this didn't. And there are probably people who go well, actually no, uh, classic, you're wrong. Well. You know, apart from like Metal Gear and games like that that I've already mentioned, give me a game that actually came out that like Tomb Raider that had difficulties because I don't remember a game apart from the, the, the few that I mentioned. So I, I would love to know that. Oh my god. Oh, key. Another key, another door. Ah! <laughs> oh 
Oh, nice. A nice little save point. I want to complete this level. If I don't get it, I'll get this level done tonight and then I'll do the last level of this particular area of the game. Because there are three parts of this main level of Egypt. And then we're on the final levels. Jesus fucking Christ! How cool is this? An ancient room of Egypt. I mean, just buried in this area. It's just, it's just so well. I love the detail. I love it. I adore this detail. It's just so good. Normally, anyone else could push that. I'm not being funny, but normally someone could push that. Don't even think about it, Lara. Oh, hang on. I know what I'm doing now. This is the area where you get all the artifacts for that um, other stone pillar. All right, one down, one to uh, three to go. Ah. What are you doing, man? Come on, just pick it up. Thank you. <coughs> Lara, you're so shit sometimes. I hate those enemies. Fucking hate them.
I knew I didn't have to jump down. Oh my god. I can see why there is a safe crystal up here because if so I can I can imagine the fury people would feel if they climbed all the way up and then they fell down because of an un Fortunate roll off the edge like that. Yeah, note to self, keep distance from those things because they hurt. Right, that's a door. Where does that go? Ah, uh huh. Aha. What are you doing, Lara? You deserve that. You fucking deserve that.
Obviously, I can't do that. Was I actually meant to do that? I don't think I was somehow. But I'm not sure actually where I need to go now. Well, I have no idea what I need to do now. I don't know what to do now. I don't think really I was meant to do that, but it worked. I've been here already! <clears throat> Fuck's sake. Right, I'm stuck. Again. Again I'm stuck. I don't know what I'm doing. I'll come back to this in a bit. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time. Alright, so clearly it wasn't where I needed to go before, um, but for according to what he said, there's, there's a switch that make changes different positions of certain things, and we need to... We 
we don't want to do that. We want that to be down. Ha! So I'm not quite sure how you get how you get there, but I'm gonna work it out just from trying to memorise and maybe seeing it once and actually not knowing entirely what to do at all. Ah, fuck it. Well done, Lara. Brilliant job. It's exactly what I wanted to do. Right, apparently this switch changes the ramps. I think I forget how many I do have to do, which often can be bad for me. It's not always a good thing for me. Oh, we're finding a lot of uh, ammo. How many times have I gone along this fucking ledge? It's been the wrong fucking way. It's not even where I'm meant to go for crying out loud.
All right, let's talk about the cut there, guys. It just doesn't reach. Lara, what are you doing? See, this is not where I had to go because there's nothing down here. So you're not allowed to actually jump on top of the... I don't know what to do now. I'm stuck. I'm confused. I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't even know where to go. I didn't even have to come down here, man. That's what's stupid about that. So what do I do now? Because there's no... Once again, there's no explanation of what to do. Nothing. No explanation of where to go. Climb up, Lara. Don't shimmy. Right, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to, I'm going to go and look at what to do and then come back to this in a minute. All right, let's try this again, shall we? Great job, Lara. Didn't say do that, but yet you fall off anyway. All right. Now, just be warned, guys. I'm uh, in the last few weeks. I've had a lot of personal problems, hence why I, the, the sort of recordings lacks a little bit. Um, I'm fine. Overly, I'm fine. Before people worry about me, I honestly, I'm. I'm perfectly okay. Um, I've just got troubles where I'm living. Um, I've got these r this really horrible neighbours um, 
who are just hell bent on, on giving me shit and problems. And to be, to be honest, I can't. It's making me not able to sleep. I don't sleep normally anyway. I find it very hard to sleep. So, yeah, I find it very hard to sleep, and I'm on um, medication to help me sleep, just to help me get through the night. And it, I've had to take half a tablet every other day, and the taste when you take it is vile. And, I, and when I say vile, I mean it's horrible. It's this horrible, like, you, you know when you're not meant to break a tablet in half, but you do? Yeah, that's the taste I get in my mouth, and I have to wash it down with a lot of juice to even get the taste out of my mouth, and even have something like a bag of crisps or something just to take the, the edge of that ta taste, because the taste is vile. There we go, look at that, finally. <laughs> Again, I didn't want you to do that, Laura. Get up there, Cora. <laughs> Yeah, great job, Lara. I didn't want to do that. I think I might just finish the video in a minute.
But I want I, I want to get the final piece. But I just know that now that I've taken my meds, I'm probably not going to be able to stay awake for that long. So I'm probably just going to finish it here, guys. We've got three out of the four, but I'm not going to I'm not going to call it a video. I'm just going to cut the video here, um, because I'm not going to be able to stay awake. I don't think I'm going to look up what to do. Probably watch it on my tablet. So I'll I'll come back to you very shortly. It'll be in a few hours for me, or in some hours for me, but it'll be a minute for you. So I'll see you in a sec. All right, we have one more to go. Now, you can do this, which is obviously what you need to do. We haven't yet got this, which we need to pick that up. All right, so I think I think this is now going to have a yes. I don't remember this being climbable before. Alright, so this this thing here, I will obviously speed up a little bit to get us up to the top quicker. These kind of like slow things, I will do that. While my cat comes and runs past my leg to obviously show, to obviously pet, want me for something. I think she wants to come up and have affection. Well, she can she can jump up. You know, she's now nearly eight years old and she still forgets how to jump up and see me. I love her very much. I'll give her some attention. There you go, socks. Yeah, I know. Hello. Ooh. Aha. She oh. is proper affectionate right now. Almost like she knows that I'm going to go to bed. And just before I go to bed, she doesn't still normally sleep on my feet or anything. She's not that type of cat. I mean, sometimes she does. She'll come and sit, she'll come and be sleeping on me in the morning. When she knows she's going to get fed. Because a lot of time, all she... What the fuck was that?
I just exited the game. Well, we've got all four of them now, but I don't know where to go after you do all this. Yeah, that's complete. <laughs> Let's save it here. I think I know what I'm doing now. Now can I jump down? How do you get back there? That's what I want to know.
doesn't want to do that, Lara. want to get to the end get to the end before I actually start falling asleep brilliant Where is that? Gearing us up for something. I've got 600 bullets in my mag. Because I'm not quick enough, I'm going to die.
you gonna turn? Are you gonna turn? Hello? Lara? Are you gonna turn or are you gonna be an idiot? You're not turning. Refuses to turn. Alright, you can stop doing that. You can stop doing that. You can stop. You can stop doing now, idiot. Lara, you can stop doing. Stop doing the jump. Is. Alright, another technical fucking glitch. All the way along we swim. All the way along. Collected all the items, done it all off screen. Save Crystal. Here we go. No. Scar beetle.
this one is the other round shaped one. I love how it actually gets pushed. Because normally the iron would be invisible or would be very, very, very not very well, but it actually shows an animation of putting it in, which I think is really cool. And this is going to be the end of the level. And the end of this very long drawn video. But as always guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. Hope this is the end. Yep, yeah, it's the end. One secret out of three, I'll take it. 12 kills, 30 pickups, 45 minutes. Alright then guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Hi guys, Classic Gamer here. Thank you very much for watching this video. This was recorded and edited by my good self. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. And if you want to see more, subscribe to the channel and hit that bell so you get notified of when I upload more videos. And with that being said, thank you very much once again guys and I'll see you in the next video. Ciao for now.